auto workers and local leaders standing side by side for better working conditions and pay. Crowds form in front of the Belvedere assembly plant to support workers' rights. 23 News reporter Jake Pearson was at the rally where United Auto Worker leaders say a message was sent to automakers. Laborers will work, but for a fair wage. Since UAW went on strike in September, laborers for Ford, GM and Stellantis have rallied together in solidarity. Those at the assembly plant on Friday were no exception, bringing as many people as possible to leave the biggest impact possible. When I say fire it up, you say ready to go, fire it up. Ready to go. Fire it up. Ready to go. In matching red shirts, laborers, leaders and their families get their defiant engines started. Matt Franzen is the president of UAW Local 1268. He set up the rally as a way to communicate with automakers. Laborers want to come back, but they won't be exploited for their hard work anymore. If we're going to send a message to the CEO, hey, we're here, we're ready to work. Put a product in here. If it's to our UAW brothers and sisters, thank you for what you're doing for us. The sacrifices that you guys are doing for us, that's why these guys have shown up. Our community stands with you, and your union brothers and sisters and siblings stand with you in solidarity. Belvedere Mayor Clinton Morris addressed the crowd at the rally, where he said he will do whatever it takes to get the Stellantis plant functioning again. Uh, I was a union employee. And with that, I was able to raise my family and have many things. But I was laid off as a UAW member in 1982. And I want to make sure that people have an opportunity to work. And I think that's my job. As of Friday, UAW President Sean Fain says Ford, GM, and Stellantis will do what they can to prevent any further work stoppages, which could mean strikes are closer to ending. Thank you, Jake. Now, members of the UAW workforce created matching red shirts with the local 1268 logo on the front, with We Are Belvedere written on the back. The shirts were passed out to everyone attending the event. 